Hello, welcome to this video. In this video, I am going to explain how to insert a shape in the Excel worksheet by using VBA macros. Here already I wrote the code. Click on developer. Click on visual basic. In module 1, we can find the code. Press F8 to start the debugging. First I am using Sheets in New Workbook property of Application Object. Here I mention value S2. This property allows the application to create new workbook with two worksheets only. Thereafter I created a variable for the workbook object. Set workbook is equal to workbooks dot add here I'm adding the workbook this is the newly created workbook we can find this workbook created with two tabs only here I am going to add the shape in sheet 2 of the newly created workbook hence I defined a variable which is named as sh and object data type is a worksheet set sh is equal to I considered the sheet 2 activating the sheet 2 next I am defining the range in the sheet 2 sh dot range l5 to q6 so I am going to add the shape in that range user can change the range based on the requirement next I defined a variable which is named as shp and object data type is shape next I am adding the shape set shp is equal to sh denotes sheet 2 in the sheet 2 I am adding the shape for that I am using add shape method of shapes object here I am copying first line of code based on the available drop down we can select the required object here I selected MSO shape rectangle thereafter I am defining the dimensions with respect to left top width height for all these dimensions I am using the range which I defined here so application going to add the shape in that particular range only now let us cross check the sheet 2 here we can find application added the shape in the range of L5 to Q6 thereafter I am formatting the shape first I am adding the caption to that shape for that I am using text frame 2 property of shape object Next I am adding the caption. Next I am increasing the font size. Next I am applying vertical anchor. Next applying horizontal anchor. Next I am changing the font name. Next I am changing the color of the font. Next I am changing the color of shape object. At the end, I am restoring sheets in new workbook property with three worksheets. Close this workbook. Let us check the output one more time. Click on the button. Here application created new workbook and in that newly created workbook, application added the shape. Hope this video is useful to everyone. Thanks for watching.